So I'm going to start with uh, memories of Michael in the bathtub as a young boy, <laughs> two or three years old, who loved to snorkel and would spend hours and hours in the bathtub. Michael, the ocean was his meditation. He'd go out and he'd say, Mom, I'm going to bring home dinner. He got a good fish, he would make a ceviche out of it. And he knew that his little sister Chelsea did not like um, cilantro, so he would specially make her a separate bowl of the ceviche without cilantro for her. And he had a dang good recipe for that, cilantro, uh, for that ceviche, it was so delicious. Yes. But, uh, you know, I think he just liked to just play around and have a good time. I think when he went diving, he was, like, fired up about it. He kind of took it seriously, I would say. Um, he came home one day with an 80-pound Ulua that he had caught at 80 feet. And he was way, I don't even know, it was called the secret dive spot, I don't even know to this day where it was, um, that he had gotten it from and you had to hike in a little bit. So he had to hike out with this 80 pound Ilua on his back and he was very proud of that. Very, very proud of that.
love you, Michael, so much, and we miss you so much, but I feel you around all the time, but yeah, your mom misses you. Love you, Michael.